Hi, in this video, I will show you how you can set up your secure folder and uh, how you can store your personal data in this folder so that you can keep your data safe and more secure. Now, first tap on the home key to take you back to your home screen. Then swipe down at the top here and tap on the settings icon. Next, you want to go down and tap on biometrics and security. Then we go down and tap on secure folder. Now we'll begin to set up the secure folder. So tap on agree. Now we need to put in the password of the Samsung account. So I'll go ahead and do that now. Because once you have put in the password, you can also uh, check the radio box to verify identity with biometrics. So next time when you need to um, verify yourself, you don't have to keep putting in the same password. We can use uh, biometrics, which is a lot faster. Then tap on the OK button. And now the setup process begin. So say add file easily, creating secure folder. So we just wait for it to um, uh, set up. Okay, now we have to set up a uh, pattern pin or password as a backup in case we um, uh, cannot use our biometrics to access. So I'm just going to choose pin and tap on next. I'm going to put one, two, three, four and tap on continued. So we can also select confirm pin without tapping OK and tap on continued. I'll put in the pin again to confirm. And that's it. So now secure folder has been uh, successfully uh, loaded. So from here, you can add apps and files to the secure folder. And any apps or files that you put in here, no one else can see it unless, uh, unless they have a pin uh, to access your secure folder. So to add apps, simply tap on the add app. And in here, you can add uh, whatever apps you like. So I'm going to choose calculator, for example, and then tap on the add button. And now this uh, uh, app is um, added to the secure folder. So whenever you are using this app, uh, all the data uh, is stored in this folder only. So it will not uh, store outside of the, this folder, which make it safe because anyone uh, trying to access uh, files from the apps, they cannot uh, do so. Uh, similar to files, you can tap on add files. And in here you can choose uh, files from your know, file explorer or from videos, images, or documents, for example. And so you can edit to your secure folder. And from here, actually, do you want to move the files or simply just to copy it? So if you do not want to store the file outside of the secure folder, then you can simply just choose the move button and it will move to your secure folder. So from now on, um, no one else can access it except you um, uh, having the password to your uh, secure folder. And that's it. That's um, pretty straightforward, uh, setting up the secure folder. There are more um, settings and customization you can do uh, if you go into settings. There are a lot of other things you can do, such as um, backing up your data, setting up uh, backup accounts, uh, backing up restores, uh, change the settings, and notifications, and other things. So you can go in here and play around with the settings. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Uh, just before I uh, finish off with the videos, to access the secure folder, you can just simply swipe up like this, and then um, there should be a secure folder in here, which you can uh, tap on it to um, get started. So, so here, keep your secure folder file safe, back up your public file so you can either choose to back up or not. Now you can see there, when I try to go into secure folder, uh, it does not require me to uh, put in the pin or password. That's because um, it has been designed like that by default. If you want to lock your secure folder, simply tap on the menu key at the top here and choose lock. And that will lock the secure folder. So the next time when you are gone in, you will need to put in the pin or password or you can use your biometrics uh, security. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video.